What's up guys, your boy Darkskin, and today we're going to be doing uh, Blazing Bash Naruto versus Blazing Bash Sasuke. Um, I know a lot of people want to know who was better, who they thought was this, who they thought was that. Um, I know in my update video I talked about it a little bit, but I didn't really know what they did, so um, just take that with a grain of salt. Uh, I'm going to be going over everything they are in this video and pretty much just telling you who's better overall or whatever the case may be. So starting out, uh, they're both 100 uh, cost skill type heart type you know that doesn't matter um this is their pve forms by the way 1900 hp 1700 hp 2300 attack 1700 attack mid range short range um honestly as far as stats go i'm gonna have to give it to naruto because uh 1700 is you know not super high but mid range mid range as a mid range unit you beat short range in pve i feel like uh, all for it uh so uh, I'm gonna give that to him, especially because he has a little bit more HP. Um, Sasuke short range, right? They're filled in, buddy. I'm just gonna. Those are both bad. Like that's equal. Both of them are bad, right? So as far as Jutsu's, 4-8 chakra, 5-10 chakra. Now that doesn't necessarily mean Sasuke automatically wins, but um, so 3.1 times attack, skill damage, one enemy for one turn, reduced damage by 30%. 6.5 times attack and skill damage to one enemy, 40% chance of immobilized, two turns, knocks him back, two turns, reduced damage by 30%. Naruto's 5 chakra 5.1 times attack to heart 50% chance of slip damage for turns 8 uh, times attack to heart damage AOE heart damage 70% uh, chance of attack reduction knocks him back 2 turns reduce damage by 20 Jutsu and ultimate Jutsu go to Sasuke because he's reducing damage by 30% not and uh, it's 4 8 chakra right now don't get me wrong Naruto having an AoE ult is really good, but I gotta give that to Sasuke on this one. As far as abilities go, right? Sasuke is a really good damage dealer, but he already has low rates as far as, um, as far as, uh, Jutsu. Like, 3.1 times attack isn't that high, right? So, um, all these damage boost and attack boost put him equal with, like, normal units, right? But Naruto can take wisdom and bravery, bravery damage. Uh, the Jutsu ceiling is whatever, but Naruto heals. So it's like, on, honestly, if Naruto didn't have the healing, I would give it to Sasuke. Because 300 attack stat extra would put him at 2600. Not to mention he has 50% to uh, bravery and wisdom. Only thing about damage boost to bravery and wisdom is that like, you already do neutral damage to them, so it's not really a problem. But with Naruto, damage reduction is just just good it's just good like it's, it's i'm sorry but it's just good not to mention he's healing so it's like he's healing and he's damage reductioning so like that's really good now if naruto didn't have that it would be sasuke going on right going on to their sync skills sync with leaf uh reduce heart damage by 15 sync with uchiha reduce damage by 15 sync with leaf reduce body damage by 15 sync with ninja alliance reduce uh I mean, restores 50 HP. I gotta give it to Sasuke because uh, reducing heart damage by 15 is good. The first one, Sync with Leaf, is equal for both of them. But Sync with Uchiha is a lot easier to get than Sync with Ninja Alliance. Not to mention, syncing with, you, you get 15% damage reduction, whereas you only get 50 health every turn. So, you know. We're not gonna go over their PvP stats because it's their PvE forms. But let's get into their PvP forms, right? So starting off, uh, like I said, hunter call, skill, heart, you know, whatever. We're not going to go over their PvE stats and stuff like that at all. Um, so yeah, field on buddy, same like I said. Uh, abilities, right? I'm going to have to give it to Sasuke off rip. Now this is why. Uh, he gets 300 attack boost, 30% to use no chakra, right? And then one immobilize. With Naruto, he has 30% to use no chakra, but the other three abilities are Jutsu still resistance, which is kind of, eh, yeah. So I'm gonna have to get at to Sasuke, right, on abilities. Six skills, I already talked about that, that goes to Sasuke. Now, as far as stats, stats, 100% gotta give it to Naruto. 42,000 HP on Sasuke, 3,600 attack on Sasuke, 231 speed on Sasuke, right? Cool. Uh, 40,000 HP on Naruto, 2,800 attack, 305 speed. The reason why I'm giving it to Naruto is because, yeah, Naruto has a little bit less attack, but... That speed difference is massive. He has 70 more speed than Sasuke. Well, 74 to be exact. But, you know, not to mention he has 2,000 less uh, HP. And, like, that's not that big a deal. All right? You don't really have any body units hitting for insane amount of damage. Whereas with Sasuke being a skill unit... Uh, thank you for whoever subscribed. With Sasuke being a skill unit, Hashirama's hitting 30k. Right? So it's like, you know, 
There it is. Going on to Jutsus. 4 8 chakra, 5 10 chakra. I already said that. Six times attack and skill damage to one enemy reduces move, uh, moves them back on the timeline and knocks them back. Now I want to know, uh, with type advantage, Sasuke's Jutsu hits for 36,000 damage. I just want to put that out there. Sasuke's ult, 13 times attack and skill damage, 60% chance of immobilize for one turn, knocks them back. Two seconds, you get reduced damage, right? Now going on to Naruto. Uh, six times attack and hard damage to all enemies in range, 40% chance of speed reduction for two turns, and 20% speed boost to self for two turns. Naruto with type advantage hits for 24,000, right? Now that's AoE for five chakra. Uh, and he gives himself a speed boost, which makes him the fastest unit in the game, which is pretty good. Uh, going on to his ult. 14 times attack and hard damage to all enemies in range, moves them back slightly on the speed gauge, knocks them back, right? Now, as far as who I think genuinely is better, I know I said Sasuke in my update video, but I think Naruto is the better unit if you had to choose. Just as far as the units that are out in PvP, and as far as the chemistry that they can bring to teams, I think Naruto is the better unit. Now, uh, Sasuke is the better PvE unit. I think, no, no, excuse me, not, no, Naruto is the better PvE unit, and Naruto is the better PvP unit, right? Not to mention, a lot of people, um, not to mention, as far as anniversary units go, Sasuke, the body Sasuke is the better unit. So it's really good that it's like that. Um, you need Sasuke for Naruto's raid, and he is the better unit of the two, in my opinion. So, um, honestly, uh, I'd say go for Sasuke as far as anniversary, and then I'd say go for Blazing Bash Naruto as far as impacts. Now, don't get me wrong. If you saw my last video I, uh, I posted, both of these units are insane, and they both work really well together. So if you can get both, go for both. So, um, anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.